Hey guys, what is up? And today is going to be another batch tutorial. Now, what we're going to be covering today is saving and loading variables into and out of the batch file. Now, in order to save variables, we're just going to open up a bracket, type echo, and the name of your variable. So in this case, HP and money. Now we're just going to close that, type a greater than sign as a director to indicate we want these variables to be saved to a file. So in this case, save load.dlb. I'm just going to save that. As you can see, save load.dlb has popped up. Now in order to prove you guys that this works, I'm going to change the value of HP to 2. And show you how to load your variables now we're just gonna open up a curly bracket type set slash p and the name of your variables again it's gonna be hp and money we're just gonna close that type a lesser than sign to indicate we want the variables to be loaded from file and that file is going to be save.dlb Go to home. I'm going to save that. Open it up. As you can see, the value of HP has changed because it is pulling the value of HP from our save file. I'm just going to close that. Now, one thing to keep in mind here you want to make sure the order of HP and money. From where you saved it is also the way you loaded it otherwise your program won't work at all and it'll just crash on you so that is going to be how to save and load variables in and out of the batch file this is going to be useful in tomorrow's tutorial where we're going to be covering how to make a batch shop for your rpg please make sure to rate like and subscribe thanks for watching <music>